America, I want to make this perfectly clear. Not all black people are alike. Take me and my wife, for example. Yeah, we both like fried chicken and the Commodores. We need lotion, stuff like that. But we came up different. When I was a boy, Big Mom used to hit me so hard, made my teeth click. I mean, I got my ass whooped. Beatings. Now, Wanda's house? <laughs> Family meetings. Sweetheart, I'm very disappointed in you. So I didn't get all that talking to. And I'm not complaining, but it made me a better man. I mean, I don't tolerate nonsense just like none was tolerated for me. Now, Wanda, on the other hand, she's soft, lenient. She go too easy on the kids. Now, I'm not saying we should beat them, although, you know, I'm just saying we're different. So if Shelly finds out Donna kissed Daniel mm -hmm. and Donna shows up, girl, at Shelly's party, mm -hmm. it's going to be a misunderstanding for sure. Ooh, really? <laughs> <laughs> there. Wow. All done. Vanessa, I love my hair like this. Girl, you could really make some money on the side. <laughs> Thanks. Hey, I'll give you the family discount. What's that? 50 bones. Ah! <laughs> it's cute, but not that cute. <laughs> Y'all got jokes. What's so funny? How come I can't know? Come on, tell me. I want to laugh. Shit. Baby, your hair is awful. <sighs> what? Thank you, sweetie. Big son. What? What I say? Look, baby, I find your panties on top of the washer. You can't leave your drawers out no more. testing the boy. America, he's soft. I just want to see if he's going to take the bait. Said he'd rather have an easy bake oven. It's not about me. It's about you. And you giving in to those kids too doggone much. But this time, Wanda, you went too far. Nessa ain't going out this house with those things on. Fine. Okay, fine. Well, it's settled. So you go in there and you tell her. Nessa, Nessa, I don't want you wearing no thong bloomers that, that your auntie bought for you. Look here, Nessa, I'm not going to argue with you about it. It's just not proper for a girl your age to be wearing panty thong. And it's not proper for you to be wearing those shiny shirts either, but do I say anything to you? Shiny? Look, Nessa. Please. You can please all you want. I'm not raising no hoochie girl up in this house. Is that Wanda hoochie? She wears thong panties. Well, how the heck you know Joe when I wanted to wear old people, Tom? You stop, uh, I deal with you. Hoochie, 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 hoochie. I hate you. Hoochie, hoochie. You can hate me all you want, but I want you to get rid of those panty thongs hoochie, today. Hoochie, hoochie. Jordan, please let girls sit down. You hear me, hoochie, Nessa? Hoochie, hoochie. Today. Hoochie, 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 hoochie. hoochie, hoochie. That's just too small. I can't break it up. Where are you going, Evil? I told her she can go to Shelly's house and burn some CDs for her party tomorrow night. That pigeon toe girl live up the street? Yes, Barney. <laughs> Vanessa, <laughs> have fun. Vanessa, are you. Tell Shelly's mother I said hello. Oh, I saw that. I don't know what they said, but I saw this. 
And I have a very scientific method for breaking down you ladies' secret communication, which I'm not in liberty to discuss. But I saw that. You saw it. We saw it together. What was that all about? What was what? You know what was what. You can act dumb all you want to. Nessa did this, then you did this. She skipped her happy ass on out of here. What did you say to her? Okay, baby. We're gonna sit right here until you tell me. What did you say, Wanda? She was wearing the thong underwear, okay? Oh, Wanda, you know all about it. You let her go out of here like that? Cahoots! It was just a little secret between us girls. It can't be no secret, baby. Well, I'm trying to teach them right from wrong. Ain't no wiggle room with right from wrong. Can we have a cookie? Just no. one each. Thanks! <laughs> See? You know what, Bernie? I'm not their mother. You know, I like being the fun auntie. See, just like those panty thongs. You got these kids thinking they run the show around here. No. I just don't think there's anything wrong with those underwear. But I do. And I feel strongly about it. That should be enough. I never looked at it like that. Well, that's the way it's supposed to be. See, you got Dessa walking around here like she don't respect my rules because you don't. You're supposed to help me lay down the law around here. You got to help me. Are you with me? Yeah. Thank you. We know you went out with those thong panties after I told you not to. And just for that, young lady, you grounded for a week. But I miss Shelly's party, and that's not fair. I wonder. Your uncle made a rule, and he feels strong about it. And I have to respect that. So you're letting him punish me? We're punishing you. She'll probably never forgive me. That's nonsense. She'll get over it. But the most important thing, we created a united front. That's the way it gotta be. United we stand, divided we get played. Just stand there. March. Poopy head. What did she just call me? Call you poopy head, baby. Here's a chance to dance our way out of our constriction. Call the bleed freak in up and down the hang up alleyway. With a groove I only got, we shall all be moved. America, the United Front is working better than I ever could have imagined, and I love it. And now that Wanda's taking up some of the slack, I have more energy than ever. Energy for days. Think I'll go celebrate with my closest ally.
Why don't you put on that sign now, fit I like? I hate the United Front. Yeah, baby, but it's working. Yeah, they can't play us. Yeah, well, they can't stand us anymore, either. Brianna ignores me. Vanessa hates me. And Jordan told his friend that we're not really related. I'm just his aunt by marriage. That's because you Great Britain. They the Falkland Island. Now, I know you ain't gonna let no Falkland kids break you down. Yeah, but now they think I'm an idiot like you. I, uh, don't suppose you want to go to the mall with me. But I'm not off punishment until tomorrow. He won't know. He took your brother and sister to play miniature golf, so they won't be back for hours. <laughs> Thanks, Aunt Wanda. Mm-hmm. You're welcome. Man, I love this car. I hate riding in Bernie's pimp mobile. Yeah, convertible is the way to go. <laughs> one day, I'm gonna get a car just like this one. I can't wait until I can drive. What? Maybe I could teach you. To drive? For real? Yeah. I mean, you know, we can find like an empty lot on Sunday. My parents taught me how to drive when I was your age. I think it's perfectly okay. Except for we can't tell your Uncle Bernie. <laughs> so who was that boy? You were smiling kind of hard. No, I'm just... let's move on. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, for being ground, he sure got a mile out of bags there. Just a handbag and a new pair of shoes, thank you. Baby, she's supposed to be grounded. She is. We were only out for two seconds. Grounded means no seconds. We weren't really out. I didn't want to leave her here alone. I needed some pantyhose. Wanda, you and I had an agreement. We're supposed to be working together on this thing. Bernie, what makes your way so great? I mean, you treat people like they're not even civilized. They're not civilized, not even people. We're talking about kids, bad, rotten to the core. You give them an inch, they're going to take a mile. These kids here, they're going to take two miles. Trust me, honey, I know what I'm talking about. I'm sorry, I'm not that cynical. OK, fine, fine. Let me tell you something, Wanda. You're going on your own this time, OK? And don't expect me to get your back. A matter of fact, I'm kicking you out the United Front. Good. OK, good. That means you handle the kids by yourself, solo. Whatever. I'm going to tell you what whatever got to do with it, OK? Don't expect to enjoy the protection. Bernie, I don't care. I don't care. Care don't get you nowhere. She'll care. You'll see. You'll see. She'll be sorry. She'll no longer enjoy the protection of the United Front. Meaning she had to control all three territories by herself. I now consider her a rogue state. Meaning she don't own. Alone. Think for yourself. I don't care. I'm through. Gone. 86. Peace out. Yeah. We'll see. See ya. Don't want to be ya. Amanda, mm -hmm. I'm thirsty. Can I have some apple juice? No. It's late, and I want you to go to sleep. Of course you can have some juice, sugar. I'll be right back. See now? I could explain at that point that you can't give baby girl juice before bed, because it's run through her like 7-Up through a straighter. But a rogue state is not allowed access to the database of the United Front. I could have told her. But I wasn't being selfish. These are the rules. Uncle Bernie? Well, sweetheart. I want the bed. <clears throat> that ain't no problem. Honey, that's for you. Mm. Oh. Hey, hey. hey when you put Jordan in there? He's on the dresser, honey. <laughs> Jordan, if you swing that club one more time, I'm gonna do my best to knock you in the next week. 
put this shoe on Brianna and stop playing. I'm not playing with you. See, a rogue state's threats are empty as they are not backed up by the strength of a superpower. That would be me. I'm gonna go put this in the lunch bag. A rogue state does not enjoy the protection of its boundaries. See? does not enjoy the peacekeeping efforts of the United Front. And besides, I hate watching Bernie eat pizza. He always puts the sausages on his eyes and pretends he's dead. He's so stupid. All right. We'll be back soon. <laughs> Boy, say excuse me. Ask me a pepperoni. Oh. Hey, Wanda, babe, look, that lady got a car just like yours. Oh, look at her. I'm to bite my style. Yeah. See, that's a young girl, too. You had to wait till you became an old lady to get you one. <laughs> that girl got to be Vanessa's age. Hmm. Wait a minute. made you think you could take my car? Well, you said you were gonna teach me to drive anyway, so... I said maybe we can drive in an empty lot with me there! I told you. You give them an inch, they take a mile. I only went around the block. A quarter mile. Look, it's your mess, you clean it up. United Front, we take no prisoners. Are you crazy? Do you use your brain? Oh, I'm so mad I could... You could have killed somebody. But... But nothing! Your best bet is to keep your mouth shut. Go to your room until I say come out. Can't even look at you anymore. my temper. No. I yelled at her, then I told her I didn't want to look at her anymore, and then I sent her to her room. Wow, baby. That ain't like you. I mean, that's cold. I know. Cruel. Heartless. But I'm proud of you. I mean, my baby back in the front. Congratulations. brought you some pizza. I didn't think you were speaking to me. I, uh, wanted to tell you a story. I wrecked my parents' car when I was a little older than you. No way. Yeah. I had just gotten my driver's permit, and I was practicing with a friend. What happened? I just gave it a little gas, and I had on a pair of candies, you know, the ones with the wooden heels? They had candies back then? Oh, it was not that long ago. Anyway, the heel hit the paddle and bam, smack right into the mailbox. Woo, was my mama mad. <laughs> <laughs> we all make mistakes, Vanessa. But you can't do stuff like this. Otherwise, how can I trust you? And more importantly, how can I get your Uncle Bernie to trust you? I know. It was stupid. Mm-hmm. 
So, is that it? Hell no, that's not it. You're grounded. Two weeks. No TV, no phone, no internet. You heard me. I'm sorry. Two weeks. I wonder. Mm hmm. That's not how you're supposed to act if you're part of the United Front. She is back in the front, isn't she? Or maybe she's just revolutionary, like Angela Davis. What? She gonna grow a big afro next? She ain't never laugh when I punish her. And a hug is out of the question, even on a good day. America, how is that fair? That ain't fair. Cut the camera off. Don't grow a big neck. Cut it off. You know I'm right, America. She's talking about this shirt is slick. Forget her. Little heifer. Shoot. All I need is a hat, wide frame glasses, deuce in the quarter, and a white woman, and a Chinese woman, and a Mexican. Sister got to walk. Good.